Hello everyone, and welcome to my Emmerdale News YouTube channel. I hope everyone is saving a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribers button and give this video a thumbs up. Dare Ella Forster say it, but after everything that has transpired, now that everyone has come to terms with her history and she has reconciled with Liam, Johnny McPherson, things appear to be getting better for her in the Hamlet. Thus, now is the ideal moment for Emmerdale to put a wrench in things. Now that Liam is on board and she has a roof over her head following the accident that cost her her prior place of residence, her automobile, things appear to be improving. With a job at the vet, and support from Mandy and Manpreet. Ella appears to be on the verge of returning to a regular life. Ella's next great secret, which Mandy, Lisa Riley, uncovers, is that she is 30 years old. She uses her good intentions and heart in typical Mandy fashion, but unanticipated results arise. Ella is taken aback when Mandy bids her a happy birthday and feels uneasy when she is presented with before and after pictures of a beauty procedure. She reluctantly consents to it and grudgingly gives herself permission to enjoy it. Ella gets thrown for a loop when Mandy makes a move that makes her freak out and shares the before and after pictures on social media. Ella breaks down, and not just because Mandy fails to see the good in Ella, it's because Ella's well-meaning friend hasn't even thought to ask if she wants a digital trail. Lion witnesses Ella smashing her birthday cake in her blind wrath and running to the footbridge. In an effort to soothe her, the doctor approaches and offers to drive her to her surprise party. Ella is appreciative and consents to have him go with her. She is moved by the support of everyone around her when she gets to the party after the crisis has de-escalated. When Liam gives her a tiny star pendant, she is even happier, put in the aforementioned spanner. When Gary, the nephew of the lady whose daughter she killed, shows up uninvited and intends to cause the most disruption possible, everything goes haywire. Ella freezes as he walks right through the door and gives her a chilly memento of the life she took. Ella runs away in terror but stumbles badly on her route. A kind Wendy, Susan Cookson, finds her and guides her away from Gary's grievance and anger-filled road. Ella's life collapses again because of Gary's arrival, as actress Paula Lane explains to Metro.co.uk, saying that it triggers something. It's that survival instinct, I believe. She says she's still really rattled by it. For the vet's receptionist, what follows is catastrophic. Something about Wendy's attitude maybe a recollection of June, makes Ella feel intense feelings that she has been fighting to suppress while she waits in the surgery waiting area. She consequently briefly loses consciousness and viciously assaults Wendy. Paula remarks, I don't think she's ever been as unhinged as she is in that scene, implying that some unskilled prop person had a significant cleanup task ahead of them. But perhaps it's not as insane as we assumed, she continues suggesting that it might have a deeper significance. Has she lost it? Or does she have a valid cause for doing it? Is she on the verge of pretending? She hurts another person and ruins everything she has worked so hard to accomplish in the blink of an eye. Is Ella at last letting out the evil she's been holding inside? With the entrance of his hidden half-brother John Sugden, some Emmerdale viewers have surmised a fresh plot point connected to the character of Robert Sugden. In the midst of a mystery surrounding the identity of Aidan Moore, fans are curious as to whether Robert will eventually make a comeback. One popular idea holds that Robert and the enigmatic Aidan, or possibly even John, have been incarcerated together. In response to the murder of Lee Posner, who had raped Robert's sister Victoria Sugden, a few years prior, Robert is presently serving his sentence. Lee fell on the ground as Robert attacked him, but a later development suggested that Lee wasn't the one who killed him. Victoria recently learned that John, her hidden brother, has moved into the village. However, we noticed that he was carrying some dog tags bearing the name Aiden Moore 
while he refrained from discussing his military service. Of course, this led to a lot of conjecture about his identity and legitimacy. There were several possibilities, ranging from John's real identity to a potential boyfriend or a deceased loved one. However, some fans are now questioning if Aiden, whether he is John or someone else, could be connected to Robert without using DNA. Maybe it would finally lead to Robert's much-anticipated return, since many have been predicting that a comeback is imminent. Several followers asked on social media if Aiden was incarcerated alongside Robert and if his family was being targeted for an unknown cause. Some even speculated that it would result in Robert returning for a dramatic plot point on the show. Perhaps Aiden is in jail with Robert Sugden, a fan commented. Anything to do with Robert, exclaimed someone else. He ends up in a cell with Robert and finds out Emmerdale and Vic and Aaron, a third person said, then has a falling out with Robert and chooses to exact external retribution, most likely more credible than Edie's account. Some fans have noticed a potential connection between Aiden and Karen Moore, a former persona, and Jack Sugden's mistress. Could Aiden thus be the family's other secret sibling? After the puzzling name of Aiden Moore was revealed in recent scenes by John Sugden's dog tags, Emmerdale fans went into meltdown trying to solve the enigma. Online fans of the ITV soap opera were left scratching their heads over who is Aiden Moore as they tried to figure out if newcomer John, Oliver Farnworth, was lying about who he really was. When John's sister, Victoria Sugden, Isabel Hodgins, questioned him about his time in the army after finding a tin containing the enigmatic dog tags, the plot intensified. Victoria failed to notice that John's name wasn't on the tag, and his shady response told all the details. Currently, fans are left perplexed by the enigmatic John Sugden. Until now, John's past has been largely unknown, with only brief tidbits revealed here and there. It's like a locked box. However, with John on edge and trying to hide his tags, viewers can't help but wonder what secrets he's sitting on and just who Aiden is. X, formerly known as Twitter, is where fans post ideas and debate. So is he John Sugden or Aiden Moore? A fan asserted that Aiden is John's real name, while another noticed that John seemed unduly interested in Victoria during a conversation about their family, which sparked rumors of John collecting hidden information. I think he is not John Sugden, and I'll think he must be Aiden Moore, guessed another person. Some fans believe John or Aiden is attempting to flee military life. They have said things like, he's a devil and think he wanted out the army, and that is not his ID. Another fan accused John of identity theft. Theories about John perhaps having blood on his hands have led viewers to believe he is hiding a dark history. Could Aiden's death have been caused by John, or has the real John passed away? A popular belief among enthusiasts is that John Sugden passed away during combat. He is Aiden Moore, the reason John was killed in action, and he has assumed his identity. In reality, Aiden Moore is a long-lost relative of Ella's. In so opera land, you never know. The drama doesn't end there, as some viewers believe John is out to get revenge, possibly against Robert Sugden or Aaron Dingle. Rumors have been circulating regarding John and Robert's relationship, which goes beyond simple brothers. One such rumor is that John and Robert may have been former prison mates. Is John preparing a terrifying revenge plot against Aaron and Robert's family? Is he resentful that his father, Jack Sugden, supposedly knew about him but was unable to locate him? And is he now looking to his family for revenge or something more? According to a recent notion, Aiden might be a ghost from John's past. Perceptive viewers have conjectured that he could have a family connection to John, possibly having a secret sister on his mother's side. Some speculate that he might be John's deceased former flame. Fans have rushed to social media to share their opinions, with messages such as, 
I wonder if he has siblings on his mother's side going viral. Hanum, ex-lover who maybe died? Asked a commenter. Asked someone another thought. I wonder who that was? Aiden War. John may have had a past relationship. A subsequent tweet asked, Who said a boyfriend that died or he killed him? Thanks for watching if you like this video. So please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.